सिंधु जयवच पतितानाम पावने भ्यो पैष्णवे भ्यो नमो नमो महावदन्नाय कृष्ण प्रेम प्रदायते कृष्णाय कृष्ण चैतन्न नमने गौरत्विशे नमा गुरवे गौर चंद्राय राधिकाय तदाले कृष्णाय कृष्ण भक्ताय तद भक्ताय नमो नमः तवई वास्मि तवई वास्मि न जीवामि त्वया बिना इति विज्ञेयाते First of all, my heart, obeisances and the lotus feet of my Paramahatma Guru Padma, Nitya Lila, Pravesto, Mubishnu Bhada, Sota Sashimad, Bhakti Pragyan Kesho Guru Swami Maharaj. And to say in the lotus feet of my Siksha Guru, Nitya Lila, Pravesto, Mubishnu Bhada, Sota Sashimad, Bhakti Pradhan Swami Maharaj, my dear Sarnasi, Brahmachari, Vaishnav and Vyavshmi. Yesterday, I'll get you to do it now. One day, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Nirai Pandey, in his house, he was chanting the name of Gopi, 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 Gopi. And same time, a, uh, a student of any school, he came to meet Nimai Pandey. But he saw that he is chanting, Gopi, 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 Gopi. He could not understand the why. So he asked Mahaprabhu that why you are chanting, Gopi, 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 Gopi. Why not Krishna? At that time, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was in Gopi. He was thinking, Krishna is very cruel. He can give up Shrimati Radhika even all Gopi is that even Radhika. So, like so cruel, I cannot call, chant Krishna, Krishna, Krishna. I will chant only Gopi, Gopi, Gopi. Then, when he, the student told him, why you are chanting Gopi, Gopi? You should chant Krishna. Then Mahaprabhu took his teeth and ran after him to beat him. But he ran away very fast and went to his all colleagues and told, Today I went to meet to see how is Nimai Pandi. I have heard so many wonderful things. But when I went to there and I saw that he is chanting Gopi Gopi and I asked why not Krishna, why Gopi Then he took a stick and ran after me to be, but I ran very fast and anyhow I was saved. Then his all colleagues began to tell, oh, if the Sashi, son of Sashi can do this, he can beat any of us. We will also all beat him. Anyhow, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Nimai Pandit heard this, that they want to also beat me. Then he began to think, I came, kya kofanivarite 
पिपली खंड कफ निवारी आई कैन दैट फ्रॉम गोलोक बिंदा दैट ऑल जीवस आर सफरिंग सो मच एंडलेस पेन ऑफ एंडलेस बर्थ एंड डेथ सो आई कैन टू गिव then the relation uh, 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 i came to help them to return back and to engage in krishna services but they want to beat me oh i must take sanyas and when i will take sanyas then all will honor me as a sanyas so better it is and then he made up his mind that very soon i will take sanyas now he by doing kirtan with sivasan in sivasangar and then one day he wanted that this is my last day so he went to villagers where gopalli was there and he bag milk and also loki loki mane squash 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 loki and then he met all his associates वाले नित्यानंद प्रभु चंद्रशेखर आचार्य एंड फ्यू नो दे वांटेड दैट टुडे इन नाइट ही विल गिव अप हिज हाउस हिज मदर हिज वाइफ एवरीथिंग सो हिज मदर आल्सो न्यू देन व्हेन बिकम इवनिंग he gave loki and milk to mother mother met me prepare lak laki lak laki means uh, sweet lak laki sweet part loki plus milk and boil it give some sugar Oh, it will be very, very delicious, tasteful. Mother made it and gave it to Salagram Narayan. After offering, she brought Mahaprabhu to cook it very, very tastefully. In the night, Mahaprabhu decorated himself, Nimai Pandit. He never did so. and when to his vishnu priya wife and he decorated himself gave garland gave betel nut in her mouth and he was doing shringar but vishnu priya was not happy she was thinking if any light is to be put up ki this is then it does but but more fire fire and after that is to be today i went to <coughs> take bath in ganges and when i was going Oh, my! I had a hurt, hurt man. I hurt my toe. I hurt my toe. I injured my toe. Toe in any way. And blood came. And when I was taking bath in Ganges, my nose ring. at the time of marriage 
It went to Ganges. I could not find, I searched so much. And then she came to Sachi Maya and began to weep bitterly. What will happen today? I don't know. Maya told what became and he told this story. Oh, don't worry, don't worry. Everything will be all right. Now she was thinking, perhaps any very suffering is coming to me. Now he wanted to awake, not to sleep. But by Jogumaya influence, she was trying so much not to sleep. But yet she slept. And what Chaitanya Mahaprabhu did? Oh, he became very, very cruel. And saw once towards her, and then at once gave up everything, and he began to go. Mother Sachi was standing on the gate, but she was not weeping, not anything doing. <coughs> she was like a statue. Why? For the separation mood of his son. And then Mahaprabhu oh, parik did Parikrama four times. And then he came out of the house and very near Ganges, very cold in the month of February in India, very cold. And Krishna, Krishna, Krishna telling and he jumped in the Ganges. And from there, Katwai is about 10 or 12 miles and he or swimming, he went there. And there he went to Keshav Bharati. Keshav Bharati knew him. And there he wanted that, oh Gurudev, I'm giving my body to you, this everything, surrendering, and you should give me sannyas. Do you know what is sannyas? Especially sannyas you should know that this is mantra of gopi mantra. I am taking the mood of gopi. I am gopi. And Krishna is my most beloved. Not a formality. Then he sent Mahaprabhu, Chait Nimai Pandit, to a barber nearby city. Barber told, I cannot save you. Very beautiful curved hairs. And he began to weep. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Nimai Pandit, then by his Yogamaya, he influenced that. And in the end of the day, oh, he saved him everything. And he went to Keshav Bharat. At that time, Nityananda Prabhu Chandrasekhar Acharya uh, Mukunda, five persons were there. And then he took sannyas. Now he became totally mad. Krishna, 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 Krishna. And he began to go towards Vrindavan. I will go Vrindavan. And he, he was proceeding towards Vrindavan. But at once Nityananda Prabhu oh, told some boys were playing and some cows they were grazing. Nityananda Prabhu told the boys, cowherd boys, 
if that person is coming and he will ask you where the way of Vrindavan, that then you should tell here. Oh, near Jam Ganges is there. Uh, Kalna, Santipu. Oh, this side Kalna and this side Santipu. And Nityananda Prabhu has sent a message to Advaita Charge. I am very soon bringing Mahaprabhu here. And then, when he asked the cowherd boy, Oh, can you show me the way of Vrindavan? Oh, Vrindavan is very nearer here, here, this side. And they diverted him towards some people. He went to the Yamuna side and he said, Oh, oh it is not Yamuna. This is not Vrindavan. Where I came? There I am saying, on the other side, Santipu, and here Advaitachar, Nityananda, and others. He told Advaitachar, are you in Vrindavan? He told, yes, I am in Vrindavan. This, this side river is Jamuna, that side Ganges. So please come with me. And then he took on the boat for Sarli and went to Santipur. In Santipur, thousands and thousands of, millions of persons from here and there, from Bayapu, from Navadhi, from here and there, Santipur, they came to see Mahaprabhu. Mother Sachi was also there. When now Sanyasi Chaitanya Mahaprabhu saw his mother. He gave his head on her feet and told, Mother, I have done wrong. I left you all. There is none to support you and to nourish you. If you will tell, Again I will give up sannyas and I will return back to home. Then Sachimaya knew all the sastra and etiquette and he weeping told, no problem, no my son, you should be in sannyas. And one thing more I want that you should not go to Vrindavan. From here, nearer is Jagannath Puri. You should go there. And you should live there. Sometimes you can come to take bath of Ganges. Sometimes so many devotees will go Jagannath Puri for Rath Jatra. And they will give your mess message to me. Then anyhow I can keep my life. Mahaprabhu told, yes, I will follow your order. She told Advaita Char, I want to beg you something. He told her, what do you want to beg? I want to beg that. Until, uh, till my son is here, I will cook my own hand and I will give prasadam to him. Advaita Chat told me, yes, you can do. And then thus, thousands and thousands of devotees came from here, there, from all sides. And Mahaprabhu, sometimes coming out of room and giving darshan sometimes inside, if inside, then they all began to shout it, shout, oh, oh, give darshan, give darshan. In this way, how many days I don't remember. Ten days was here. In the meantime, Rahunath Das, a boy, Antare Kara Nishtha, Bahiya Lok Bevar, 
અચિરાતે કૃષ્ણ તો મારે ભરી બેન નું ઉદ્ધાર મરકટ ના બરાજ્ય ના કરો રોગ દેખાયા તથા જો કે વિષય બહુ જો આના વોટ મીનિંગ that ragnath don't be restless return back to your home krame krame ki na na first line oh sthir haiya ghare jao na ho baku don't be mad you should return back that time has not come it will come automatically you will be matured for giving giving up your house so return back and then inside you should remember krishna and outside you should behave your father mother your wife and all others like others don't disclose i am detached from them show them outwardly and always remember grama katha na sunbe na bolibe don't tell any mundane talk and don't hear also and they ask krish very soon will tell for you and you can come to me and after 10 days चैतन्य महाप्रभु जगन्नाथ खिलचोरा गोपीनाथ एंड हि टोल टू भक्त नितानंद वॉट हि टोल हुई टेल you yes oh i don't know that that So, uh, Guru Vey Gora Chanda Rari Kaya Tadale Krishna Ya Krishna Bhakta Ya Tata Bhakta Ya Namo Nama Sri Krishna Chaitanya Prabhu Nityananda Sri Advaita Gadadha Siva Sri Gora Bhakta Vinda Panchatat Patpakam Krishna Bhakta Rupa Surupakam Bhakta Bhattaram Bhakta Kyam Namami Bhakta Shakti Kyam So first, <coughs> I give pranams thousands of times Lotus Feet of Sri Gurudev Chidandi Sanyasis, Brahmacharis, Vaishnavas, Vaishnavis, ladies and gentlemen. So we are hearing the nectarian pastimes of Sri Gauranga Mahaprabhu Sanyas. Actually, for the, vi- the devotees of Navadvi, the pastimes of Gauranga is like a spear in the heart. Therefore, Navahari Chakravati Thakur said, when that time will come, when Gaurahari will come back to Navadvi, and with his long hair, as a grihasta again we can do kirtan in the house of shrivas thakur there were all the vaishnavas were left weeping in mayapur and marvel with just a few devotees especially shri gadadha pandit shri mukunda shri chandrashekar shri nityananda bro they left their katwe where mahapur took sanyas from keshav bharati and came down towards shri jagannath puri then they can do kecho gopinath ramuna so there is a very beautiful deity of shri krishna that was personally carved by the hands of shri bhagavan ramachandra sita devi had a desire to see shri krishna's ram's form in shri in dwapar yuga therefore ram with his own hands he carved that very attractive deity so there shri nitinanda bro he told the history of kecho gopinath and all the vaishnavas there were hearing Shri Madhavendra Puri is described to be the Prem Ankur, the sprout of Braja Prem in this world. Shri Madhavendra Puri, he was from North India. Therefore he was, and he was always absorbed in Krishna Prem. It said he did not know if it was daytime or if it was nighttime. 
So he came to Brajamandu Parikram. So there his prem increased thousands of times. And there, near Govinda Kund, he was taking rest. Sri Madhavendra Puri, he never begged food or prasad from anyone. Whatever come automatically by the arrangement of Krishna, he would take that. So one night, in Bhagavad Gita, Krishna says, Ananya chinta yukta mam ye janu parupasate, tesham yukta biyukta nam yogek shemam yaham yaham. That person who exclusively thinks of me, whatever he needs, I give him, and whatever he has, I maintain. Therefore, Krishna himself came there with a pot of milk. Then Madhavendra Puri was very charmed. He could not understand this was Krishna. Because Vaishnav Seva gives such a happiness, even Krishna wants to taste that. Therefore, Krishna came in the disguised form, otherwise Madhavendra Puri, how he would accept the service from the hands of Krishna directly. That boy was very beautiful, and his voice was sweeter than millions of cuckoos. Then Madhavendra Puri was charmed. He asked, Oh Lala, where are you from? He said, I live here in Vrindavan, and my seva is, that person who never asks for anything, I give them what they need. That's my duty in Vrindavan. He gave Madhavendra Puri that milk and then he said, Baba, I have to go now and milk the cows, but I will come back to collect my pot. Sri Madhavendra Puri was waiting, waiting, but that boy never returned. Madhavendra Puri could not take his mind off the beauty of that boy. Then he was thinking, who is that boy that can attract my mind? In this world, nothing can attract me. So at night time, he had a dream and that same boy came. Who am I? Ami Nam Gopul, Ami Govadanadari. My name is Gopal and I lift Govardhan. I am suffering a long time here because when the Muslims attacked the Pujari, he buried me under the ground. Therefore, many years I have not had anything to eat or drink. Therefore, in the morning, Madhavendra Puri woke full of ecstasy and he called the villagers and they dug in the ground and they manifested the beautiful deity of Gopal. So there Madhavendra Puri began the Seva Puja of Gopal. That village offered all their chapatis, rice, sabji, ghee, yogurt, mountains and mountains. And Madhavendra Puri with his own hands offered everything to Gopal. The next village heard and the next day that whole village offered the Mahotsav. So this is Anukut, the same festival we do at Guru Dev in Govardhan. So gradually so many cows, so much land was donated to Gopal. But Sri Madhavendra Puri had a dream and Gopal said, Ari Baba, my body is burning because for many years I could not have anything to eat or drink. Therefore, please go to South India and bring some sandalwood to paste on my body. That time, how old was Madhavendra Puri? More than 80 years old. Gurudev says, why the deity does not talk to us? Just imagine if it was winter time and very cold. Imagine if it was very cold and the deity appeared in our dream and said, Vijay, I am very cold and hungry. Please make me some puri. That time Vijay is thinking, Baba, it's very cold. How I can wake up? Also, I have many work to do tomorrow. It must be a bad dream. <laughs> because Krishna knows we would not follow his instruction. Krishna never gives us darshan. He never gives us order. We cannot follow even Gurudev's order in this world. Then what will do if Krishna gives us any instruction? So Sri Madhavendra Puri, old age, oh, he went alone and walked down to South India. Then he came to that same temple in Ramuna, and there they offer a very famous type of kia. Sri Madhav Amrit Kelly. Amrit Kelly. So Madhavendra Puri was thinking, if I could taste that kia, then I could know I could make the same preparation for my deity in Vrindavan. Madhavendra Puri was not thinking to enjoy, he was thinking how to offer more service to Krishna. But then he thought, Dikka Hamaram, my mind is very wicked. That has not been offered to Krishna and I am thinking of eating it. Oh, I will punish my ma I will punish you tongue, I will not give you anything. And Madhavendra Puri left and went to the solitary place to take rest. So the Pujari was sleeping and Gopal, Gopinath appeared in the mind of the Pujari. You offered me 12 cups of kia, but one cup of kia I kept behind my, behind my cloth. In the market is one sannyasi. And my desire is you take that kia for him and give it to him. 
His name is Madhavendra Puri. So the Pujari woke up. What did he do? First he took bath. <laughs> because in Pujari, there's so many rules and regulations. Nowadays we think, I'm such an elevated rustic Vaishnav, I don't have to follow any Varnashram, I don't have to follow any rules, I don't have to follow anything because I'm a liberated Paramahamsa. But that Pujari was on such a platform, Krishna is speaking directly before him and what did he do? Got up, took bath. Then he went and took the kia, wiped the place and he went to the market. Oh, has anybody seen Madhavendra Puri? He is the most fortunate person in the three worlds. Because Gopinath has stolen, stolen sweet rice for him. Therefore that deity got the name Kir Chor Gopinath. Kir means sweet rice. Chor means a thief. One That Gopinath who steals sweet rice for his, for his devotee. Therefore Krishna is thinking, I have so many bad names. If you go to Vrindavan, then what the Brijabhasis will not say about Krishna. Then one more fault, no harm. <laughs> so that time Madhavendra Puri, he took the sweet rice, he became full of bliss and ecstasy. And that clay pot, every day he would break a piece and eat it. So all the devotees were going down. That time Nityananda Prabhu, uh, Mahaprabhu gave his danda for Jagadananda Pandit to hold. Then Jagadananda Pandit was holding the danda and the kamandalu of Mahaprabhu. So Mahaprabhu was going begging some vegetables to cook and rice. So Sri Nityanandapur, he saw the Danda and he became full of anger. Danda, how dare you? My Lord is worshipped by Paramahamsas and my Lord will have to spend the rest of his life carrying you. Therefore Nityananda became full of anger. Oh Danda, you are the cause of all the suffering of the Nabhubhibhasis. Because of you, Mother Sachi is weeping and Vishnu Priya is left alone. Therefore Sri Nityanandapur, he took the Danda and he broke it into three places. Then he became full of fear. <laughs> and he uh, threw it out in the He river. threw it in the Dandabanga river. One river is there. Now that river is Dandabanga. Dandabanga river. So then he became afraid. Oh my God, what have I done now? Then Mapu came back and he saw the broken Kamandalu and he asked Jagadananda, where's my Danda? I gave it to you. Then Jagadananda was afraid. <laughs> who has done, who, you ask your three part, Nityananda, what happened to the Danda? Then Nityananda said, who made the Danda? He broke the Danda, no? <laughs> then Nityananda also said, you broke it. You are unconscious, you fell on your own Danda and you broke the Danda. I had nothing to do with this. Then Mapu became angry. You don't know the Danda. The Danda is the residing place of the 33 million demigods is directly Vishnu himself and you threw it up and gave it up. What type of Vaishnava are you? All you devotees are just disturbing me. Therefore you go ahead and I will come after or I will go ahead and you will come after. Then the Vaishnava said, Oh Lord, you go to Jagannath Puri and we will follow from behind. Then Mahaprabhu proceeded toward Jagannath Puri and he came to Sakshi Gopal. And uh, the story of Sakshi Gopal, uh, Rasananda Prabhu will speak. I am don't know English. So, Gurudev, give me a Firstly, give me an to me. Oh, my Gyanati Viram Jasya, Gyananjana Salakaya. Chaksur Militam Jena Tasmai Sri Gurabi Nama Gurabi Gaura Chandraya Radhika Istadale Krishna Krishna Bhaktaya Tad Bhaktaya Namo Namaha Sri Krishna Chaitanya Prabhunita Nanda Sri Advaita Gadadhar Sri Vasadi Gaur Bhakta Vrinda Bala Hari Krishna Hari Krishna 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 Hari 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 Rama Hari Rama 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 Hari Hari Past my effort, my offenses, my Gurudev Nithila Pravishnu Vishnu Pad Ashtodara Sada Sri 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 Madhubhakti Sri Ru Siddhanti Goswami Maharaj. After my same, when says I offer my Sikha Gurudev, 
परिव्रज का आचार्य जितेंद्र स्वामी श्री श्री मद भक्ति वेदांत नारायण गोस्वामी महाराज अल वैष्णव एंड वैष्णव वन सेवन एट आई टू ब्राह्मण वन ए ओल्ड ब्राह्मण एंड वन ए यंग ब्राह्मण दे आर वेंट फॉर सम पिलिग्रिम प्लेस प्लेस एंड व्हेन दे आर कम दे आर कम टू वृंदावन स्टे दे आर वन ए गोपाल टेंपल when they are stay there who is the very old brahman now he is so happy why he is very so old and who is a young brahman he do so much help to him that is pilgrim pilgrim yeah, travel so without this young brahman he cannot do this pilgrim nat jatra pilgrim travel so now he become so happy now this friend of gopal this old brahman he told this young brahman bolo o oh, young brahman you are my look to your as my son so i am so happy to you you know bidai me to you i cannot do travel this pilgrim place so i am happy but i have want to give something to you bolo well, what well i have a one very beautiful young girl so when daughter So when I will return, I want my daughter give to you with you marriage. Then this young Brahman told, "This is impossible." Well, why? Well, even you are both he is the Brahman, but I am you are very highest Brahman. I am very lowest Brahman. But this thing you can told, but your family cannot accept this thing. Well, this is my daughter, my daughter. So I am. I am do bow. So I am must. I give to you my daughter to you. Well, if you return and your family this thing not don't accept, and then what happen? Well, I am you know this front of this Gopal. I am take this bow bow. I must. I give my daughter to you. But when they are both with the return, one day this old Brahman he calling this whole family. this uh, son and this wife this daughter and he tell this all past time then this family became very angry this son well how is the possible well, indian tradition is the this rule is the so hard if you there both is the brahman the, then this son told if you gave our our the sister to this brahman then you are drink this poison you can let this body well you don't then this old brahman told but i am waiting as the front of this gopal then what happened well gopal he the stone he did not come to hear this witness then well pitaji you don't worry if this young brahman came here you make some excuse the i am what i get promised to you i am don't know and i am forget i am don't know so that then what can i do you can do you don't worry after some days the young brahmani thi oh this old brahmani he promised he must give his her daughter to me but now he is tough he don't tell anything now then one day this young brahman came this old brahman house well then he told you promise you gave your daughter to me but now why you stop why did not tell anything then this old brahman he by heart he want gave her daughter to him but by force of this family now he also make some excuse well what i before told you i forget i don't know then this sir there bring you one stick well nonsense idiot Young Bra- Brahman, when you go to pilgrim journey, that time my bro- father have so much money, he stole in all money. Now he want marriage to our sister, huh? What? Sister, then he the big stick. I want to beat him. Now he is the run away. Now this young Brahmani calling all all whole villagers, and they are doing a meeting. Then meeting, then when come villagers, well, you have any witness? Well, yes. 
This is the friend of Gopal, he promised. Then this son stole, yes, he go and bring this Gopal. If this Gopal, he give witness, then you can give our daughter to you. Then no, this Gopal is the stone. He not, don't telling anything. Now this young Brahman is the devotee. He has full faith. Must this Gopal he come to here and give this witness. Now this young Brahman came to Vrindavan. This Gopal's friend of this Gopal, Valu Gopal, your friend, this old Brahman, witness, he gave her daughter to me. Now when you return, now he is the, kya bolte? And the promise? Break his promise. So necessary, you can came with me, the Jagannath Puri, by this your own mouth, you gave witness. Now this is Gopal now speaking. Well, how is the possible? I heard any dead walking. Are you heard any dead is the walk, any dead is? I am being stone, how possible I can go there? Well, if you cannot go, how you speak? When you speak, you must also walk with me. Must you come with me? Then he is the complete, he is the devotee, he completely, he is the, <coughs> what I, he completely controlled by this love affection. Well, yes, I can go, but it, and Puri, yeah, Vrindavan to Jagannath Puri, so long distance. If you want, if you want, you want, you want, you want, if you want, you want, you want, then you can. Jagannath Puri, Vidyanagar. <laughs> Vidyanagar, he does, Vidyanagar, so long distance. Well, yes, I can walk, but uh, very long distance. You can do one thing, one kilo, you know, rice, you make khichdi. And offer to me, I ate, eat, eat, then I can walk. Then he make the one kilo khichdi, and he offered, and Krishna, he all khichdi with the eight. And now, telling yes, I can follow to you, but one thing, you don't you don't look behind. If you look behind, then I can stand. Then stand there. This young Brahman he told, uh, if you don't come, what happening? Well, when I have came, well, how can I understand you follow to me? Well, one thing you do, my leg, you know, can I have uncle where. When I walk in, he is the some nice, you know. He, he can be some, some nice. He can understand I am following you, walking behind you. Well, yes, now this young Brahman is the walking. Krishna also followed him. And this uncle was nice, all come very nicely. And when he came before Vidyanagar, now they are so sad there. Now Krishna's foot is the go inside of the sand. Now this uncle was nice, now stuff. Now young Brahman thing, well why stuff this uncle well? If Krishna don't came, then what can I tell, tell this villager and king? Then he think, if I turn my face, if I look to Krishna, very close to Vidyanagar, then I can bring to everybody here. Now just he turn this face, when he saw like this, now Krishna is the stand there. Krishna told, before I told you, don't look in behind, I cannot walk now. But now bring to everybody here. Now this Brahman is the coming. He told her whole villagers and the king and the queen. Now well, Gopal, he came from the Jagann Vrindavan to here. And when all villagers, king and minister, this queen heard, Gopal by walking came Jag Vrindavan to Jagannath Puri, Vidyanagar. Everyone became very surprised. Now whole villagers, king, minister, queen, everybody there came. Krishna by walk, he came to here. When they came, really they are saw Krishna is the came here. Everybody became very surprised. Now this by own mouth, Krishna he told, well, yes, this old Brahman, front of me, he take a bow. He gave her daughter to this young Brahman. But force of this family, now he don't want to give her daughter. This is the truth. Everybody became very surprised. And this 
this queen, when he said this Gopal, is the very beautiful. Now she is a very good devotee. Now she thinks, oh, I have won a diamond no nose ring. I have won a diamond no nose ring. I want to put Krishna's nose. But how is the possible in the stone? Maybe he have no nose any hole. When this queen return and sleep, this is Gopal now he gave night time, he gave dream. Well, oh queen, you want give me your diamond nose ring? But you think my nose no any hole? Well, yes, still my nose one hole. When I am childhood, Mother Jasoda, he put one hole my nose, did one hole my nose. Still now, this hole still my nose now. If you nicely you saw, you can saw this thing. Queen is a become very surprised. Many times he told this king, Hello king, when I saw this Gopal, I think I have one diamond nose ring and I want to offer to Krishna. Well, night time Krishna, he gave dream to me. This nose has one hole. When his childhood mother Jasoda, he did one hole. Still now this hole, this nose. King also became very surprised. Now both bring this diamond nose ring. Real when they are saw, Krishna nose has one hole. And then mother, then queen, he offered to Krishna. This way, Krishna, he came to Vrindavan to Vidyanagar. So this name is the Sakhi Gopal. Sakhi meaning witness. This meaning is the you know, somebody telling you, Krishna don't tell, talking, Krishna don't walking, Krishna don't eating, Krishna don't sleeping. So our one Hindi bhajan, they are telling, Koi kahte hai bhagavan sote nahi, maya jasoda jaise tum sulate nahi. Koi kahte hai bhagavan aate nahi, draupad jaise tum bhoo. लाते नहीं कोई कहते हैं भगवान खाते नहीं सबरी जैसे तुम खिलाते नहीं मीनिंग ऑफ दिस कीर्तन समबडी थिंकिंग ओ कृष्ण डोंट स्लीप देन दिस डेवोटी टेल ये कृष्ण मस्ट स्लीप बट नेसे यू हैव लाइक दिस जसोदा मूड इफ मूड ऑफ जसोदा हाउ जसोदा व्हेन इन कृष्ण व्हेन स्लीप how Jasoda, yeah, you know, Sulata, I mean, make sleeping, only make sleep, Jasoda only make sleep to Krishna. Somebody telling Krishna is not coming, telling, next you calling like this Draupadi. When Draupadi is calling to Krishna, call to Krishna, that time Krishna is the appear and give this cloth. Somebody telling Krishna is the don't eat, well eat, you, you make like this Sabari. When Sabari, when Ram came to Sabari's house, that time Sabari's remnant, Ram Chandra ate, himself he ate, ate. So necessary you have some love affection. Your in heart is the love affection, like the Sanatana Goswami, when he offered without salty, wrote chapati, that time Krishna accepted this thing. Yes. So Krishna only he controlled by love affection. If your love affects us, you are doing bhajan and kirtan, Krishna also one day he gave prem to us. Hare Krishna. When Nityananda Prabhu, oh, what? Bhanga Prabhu? Broke the dand of Mahaprabhu. Mahaprabhu became some angry. And then told them, You all should go first to Jagannath. Either I will go first. I cannot go with you. Always making problem for me. Then they told Prabhu, You should go alone. We will come later on. Then Mahaprabhu, when come to Dandabhanga, um, Athara Nala, he did pranam and he became in mood, Bhava 
and then he began to run towards Jagannath Dev. When he entered the Jagannath temple and he saw Jagannath, Jagannath he saw not Baladev and Subhadra and playing on flute. O Brajanjananda, Tumar Bina Phate Mor Pran, Mor Pran Nath Murali Badan. Kaha Jaun, Kaha Paun Murali Badan. O my dear flute wala, where you are? After a long time I have met you. Without your separate, in your separation, my heart is broken. And thus he ran madly to embrace Jagannath Dev. When he reached nearby, oh, the gods, oh, they stopped him and they began to beat with a stick, not, it will Make only sound, not hit. Not hit. So, and there, when they stopped, he became faint totally. No sense at all. Then the gods began to try to beat him and take him out of temple. But in the meantime, Sarvam Bhattacharya, he was Brihaspati. He came and saw. Oh, so symptoms of praying are seen in him. Mahabhav. It is not seen any human being, but I am seeing. And all the symptoms are like God, Supreme Lord. Who is he? He could not decide. But anyhow, he told his servants that take him in this stage to my house and there he will come in sense. Then he went there. After that, Nityananda Prabhu and others that party, they came and searching Mahaprabhu, they, didn't, don't, they did not saw him and then someone talking each other. Oh, that sannyasi was very high class of sannyasi. And he became friend and he ran away to embrace Jagannath. Hearing this, they, were, they decided, no, he is in Sarvam house and then all went there. And they began, when they saw Mahaprabhu, they began to do kirtan uh, around him. Hearing kirtan, or oh, some breath came gradually. And then Sarvam Bhattacharya told to Gopinath Acharya, brother in love Sarvam, he was the inhabitant of first Naudi. So he knew about Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. He knew all everything. So one day Sarvam told, I want to teach that boy Sannyasi Vedanta. And thus he can save his Sannyasi. Otherwise he is so beautiful young, he cannot save his young. He may fall down. Then Gopinatha Charge told, Though you are so intelligent and learned person, but you don't know anything. Oh, he is not a uh, ordinary boy and sannyasi. He is himself Avatari Krishna. He has come to fulfill his desire. Sarvam Bhattacharya told, Oh, in this Kali Yuga, no avatar. 
the no incarnation of Krishna. So how he can be? Oh, you cannot decide by intelligence. Shatra has told, but you don't know the meaning. He is not simply incarnation of Krishna, but himself Krishna, Avatari Krishna. He told, his disciples told Sarvambhattachar, how do you know? Oh, to whom he has merciful to them, and he will mercifully eh, inspire that I am Supreme Lord, then anyone can. Uh, like uh, one slok of Upanishad. Nayam Atma Pravachane Na Lapta Na Medhaya Na Chak Pahuna Jam Eva Esa Bhidite Tem Eva Lapta To whom I am merciful, oh, I myself revel with them. So, you cannot know. One day it will come and, and you will see. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu told to Sarvam Bhatt and Bal Sanyas, I cannot save my Sanyas. So please, you are like my father and like my guru. You should teach me Vedanta. I will hear. And then he began to hear. And what became? Suddhadvaiti Maharaj will try to tell. Very good arguments, interesting, and he got oh, oh. <coughs> cut all the arguments of Mayabhav and established Krishna, beautiful, sweet, pastimes, name, Gun, Roop, Nida. Omajyan Dhamiranda Sya Gyanam Janda Shalaka Shakshuni Tamina Tasma Shri Gura Venama. So we just heard from the Lord's Mouse of Shri Gurudev how Savamavata Chaya, when he saw that Mahabharata,